Hello, my name is Akil Dinesh Kushairi bin Dedi Gunawan and today I'm going to present my water supply system model. Here's the list of materials that I use. First, I use paper straws, plastic bowls, uh, recycled small food containers, facial cottons, colored A4 papers, a toy house, and a mounting board. Here's the materials that I use during the process watercolor, brush, and scissors. So now, I'm going to show you the steps on how to build a water supply system model. So, for my water reservoir, I just painted it with light blue watercolor. And now, for my filtration, I just painted the food container using a light blue watercolor. And at the middle, I use cotton and cut it into half and colored it with grey. And for the leaf, I just cut the green colored paper uh, into pieces. Next, for the pump station, I just cut the cotton into that shape and colored it with black on the middle. Now for oxidation, I just cut the colored paper into pyramid kind of shape and painted the middle with like blue watercolor. Next is coagulation. I painted the food container using like blue watercolor. For the pipes, I just used paper straws and I used black colored paper to cut it into that fan kind of shape. And I just draw the arrow to show how it moves. Now for sedimentation, I just painted the bottom of the food container using brown and I painted like blue at the top of the container. Now for filtration, I painted it using like stripes kind of technique. It's light blue, grey, brown, black, and light blue again at the top. Now for the chlorination and fluoridation. I painted the small food container using light blue watercolor. For the pipes, I just use paper straws. Now for the clean water tank. I use medium food container and painted it with light blue watercolor. Now for the pump. I build it just the same as the pump station one, as the previous one, and I cut it into that shape and painted it with black on the middle. Now for the storage tank, I just used the plastic bowl and painted it with light blue. And for the house, I just used my toy house. Just to be clear, for my water supply system model, the pipes I use paper straws for all of it. Now I will explain water supply system and its function. The water from water reservoir will flow to filtration. It removes large suspended particles such as tree branches and leaves. The water will flow into pump station and the pump station will pump the water into oxidation. So the process here is incre it increases oxygen content in the water to get rid of unpleasant smells and taste. Now the water will flow into the coagulation. Alum is added so that mud particles stick together and sink to the bottom of the tank. Slick lime, or it is called as calcium hydroxide, is added to reduce the acidity of water. Now for uh, now the water will flow into sedimentation. Its suspended particles deposit at the bottom of the tank. It flows again into filtration. For the filtration, it removes remaining suspended particles through sand filters. It flows into chlorination and fluoridation. For that, it, the chlorine is added to kill microorganisms in water. Sodium fluoride is added to prevent tooth decay. Now it flows to clean water tank and it, it is flow again into pump and it pump into storage tank. It storage all of the water into this tank and it flows again into our house. That's the last one of it. So that's it. I finally completed my video task for my water supply system model. And that's all. Thank you for watching.